If you upend a dollar store utensil tray, you get the perfect Hot Wheels shelf. It'll hold nine cars. So that's perfect. But actually, there's one more thing I'm going to do. Just give me one second. There we go. Because these three char cars are not my original childhood ones. Well, actually, that was a grade one birthday present. A friend gave me that in grade three or four. And I picked up this uh, original 1968 Hot Heap car, Red Lines. But these are the ones that I had as a child. So you can see the, uh, the four white wall wheels cars that I got in 1990. Those were like my last childhood Hot Wheels. Two of the black wall wheels ones and my Hot Wheels transport truck, which just fits in there with the steering wheel that turns the cab. And it, these are my, so let's see, the rest of my Hot Wheels are in here. So actually I'll see, there you go. That's an incomplete Hot Heap car. These are the Micro Machines, which are color changers also. All right, so this is my uh, original 36 childhood cars. You can see the two color changers here. I actually have three Ferraris, two Corvettes, two, I believe it's a 55 Chevy, or maybe a 57. No, that says 55. This is a color changer also. So is the van. And then, of course, you have the gold chrome series that survived the house fire in 1981. So that is the first tray. This is the second tray. So most of these are my childhood cars or an intact version of them. So you have the... Uh, Let's see, what do we have here? This is the uh, sheriff car. It says, whoop, hmm, copyright 1977. This should be the fire chief car. And this is my childhood, uh, hmm. Highway Patrol car. There you are. Hmm. Okay, so that's the uh, set. Oh, and this is the um, it's my favorite car for my nephew to play with. It is the uh, Hot Wheels Pit Crew Red Line from 1971. But the back opens up, so I'll show you that. So you can see here how the back opens up, and you can see the tray. Of wrenches and tools in the back of the car. And this is my third tray. So you have the, uh, I guess that's either a cheetah or a tiger car with the super fast wheels. You have a few, um, like you have the snowplow truck. You have the, uh, I believe it's called the Baja Breaker. Yep, it has real rubber tires, although I'm missing one of them. Hmm. And you have the disaster rescue car. And you have my uh, Transformers car. Well, it looks like a Transformers anyway. I've had this since I was a kid. And the Stutz and the... What does this one say? Well, it doesn't say exactly what car it is, but that's definitely an 80s look. And the little helicopter. Oh, and the, uh, the Hot Wheels racing car. <laughs> Alright, and you can see the other cars from my uh, childhood... You can see all the other cars from my childhood in here. Not all of them are Hot Wheels, of course, but some of them are. That's the uh, 80s wheels. 
don't know why the camera keeps cutting out. There you go. Lots of Hot Wheels as well. And the Hot Wheels tank. Now, I believe the Hot Wheels tank... Gosh, give me one that. Alright, here's the Hot Wheels tank. It has a rotating turret, of course. And if memory serves... Oh, there we go. The back. The back opens to show the men inside. So I have two tow-like trucks. So there's one. There are... Now, I know there's a mix of Matchbox in here, but since these are both Matchbox cases, it's not too bad a thing. And then the last uh, Hot Wheels in the car should be a uh, Testarossa, if I remember right. I actually have a model kit of that one. And, of course, I have my the Hot Wheels service center that I found at an antique shop almost four years ago. And my from, from my childhood, my Hot Wheels red and yellow track set. I have almost everything except one uh, ramp support. So I just bring the two ramps closer together. And it all works out. 